playoffs. The first round of the playoffs is busy for Denton ISD. Three of our four teams advance to the winner go home portion of the season. Ryan is the only team forced to hit the road, but they made Brewer feel an awful lot like home. The big plays come early and often. Sanders play action, throws a bomb down the field. He's got a man there and it is caught on the run inside the 10 and shoved out at the three yard line. Toski Dove with a man all over him. First down and goal for Ryan. Spencer Sanders scores on the next play and Ryan is on the board. Ryan's motto this season is eat or be eaten. On this play, the defense eats. Tyreek Davis forces the football loose and recovers the fumble. That gives Ryan the short field and they take full advantage. Sanders to Jimmy Love. Love is tackled just inches short of the goal line. Sanders scores on the next play. It's 14-0 Ryan. About the only thing missing now is a big special teams play. Late in the first half, the Raiders get it. Fourth down and 25, here is the punt, and the punt is blocked into the end zone, picked up out of the sky and run in for the Ryan touchdown. Toby Birch blocked it, and picking it up was Thomas Wilson. That puts Ryan up by 20. The Raiders go on to win by more than that. Ryan advances to the second round with a 54-13 win over Brewer. Geyer gets to start the playoffs at home against Byron Nelson. They earn that right by playing strong during the regular season. They earn their first touchdown by running strong. Noah Kane bounces it outside and uses an extraordinary effort to get to the pylon for six. The Wildcats are having a little trouble shaking loose of Byron Nelson until Tabo Wanike makes a momentum altering play. His big hit seems to wake up the Wildcats on both sides of the ball. The next time Geyer gets the ball, they find the end zone. A very well blocked play allows Wanike to score and Geyer regains the lead. A little later, Christian Moore takes the handoff, finds some room on the outside, and he scores too. Geyer runs away from Byron Nelson and moves on to the second round. Wildcats win by 31, 52 to 21. Across town, Denton High gets one more chance to play in the friendly confines of Bronco Field. And they come out ready to go. The opening kickoff is a stroke of brilliance. Robert Reyes' pooch kick is perfectly placed. Tony Tony Atoye is there for the recovery. Denton High snatches the early momentum, and they make the most of it. Caleb Oswafa bounces it outside and gets into the end zone. It takes just 91 seconds for Denton High to take the lead. The Bronco defense also comes out of the locker room ready to play. CJ Herrera jumps all over the short pass and gets the pick. Isaiah Wofford makes sure that outstanding defensive play doesn't go to waste. He fights his way into the end zone. The Broncos lead by two scores, but that hot start cools, and the Broncos lose a heartbreaker. Denton High's fantastic season ends in the playoffs with a 31-29 loss to Justin Northwest. 